James here with Rogue Duelist Trade. In partnership with ProPlay Games, we have started the very first Yu-Gi-Oh! Investments Patreon. On this Patreon, you'll have access to near wholesale rates on Yu-Gi-Oh! product, as well as some key advice and information on the newest releases. Get distribution light connections on the newest product as low as $649 per case. Not to mention some exclusive perks, including Q&As and product ratio videos on release. No matter which tier, our goal is to help you make Make a successful side business out of Yu-Gi-Oh. Don't wait, spots are limited. Check out our Patreon today in the link below. I'll see you there. What is up guys, we are live here at Pro Play Games with our case tournament winner. This was a week ago, I guess. Uh, Grand Maju finally got him on the channel, had to work a few times, missed you, unfortunately. But why don't you tell everybody what you won with. You beat one of the best players, I think arguably in the, uh, at least in the US, I wanna say the world, Ruben Van Aranda with rocks when Adam Antipater was full power. And I can only imagine, you're excited about the ban list. What do you think about the ban list, man? The ban list, stopping all the combo decks. <laughs> Now and now you thrive. Now I thrive. Now you thrive. <laughs> All right, man. Tell us uh, what what you play and why. I play anti meta stun with Grand Maju. Okay. I figure this deck would win because it stops the whole meta. <laughs> stop, stop. All right. Let's stop. see. The, is she the, the showstopper? Let's check it out. For monsters, we start with three Grand Manjus. Okay. Let's flip them over this way, actually. Yeah, there we go. Second, we have two Idiot Millions. Okay. This powers up Grand Manju for the OTKs. The power up. Fossil Dynas, two of them. Ooh, Fossil Dynas, okay. Well, well, I thought, uh, it's a walking vanity emptiness. You're not wrong, and that card's banned, right? Yeah. <laughs> Should be. Damn, and the OG rarity, man, these are sweet. Next up, we have three Inspector Borders. Okay. A walking Majesty Sphere. Okay. Stops the meta, too, until they have it out. Next, we have the spells. We have two Lightning Storms for back row, back row removal. We have Eldritch out there, so we have to stop that. And for board wipes. Next, we have Regeki. This game has won me so many games. Nobody plays it, but I play it. Ban for a reason, boys. Yeah, have it at one. Next up, we have three Call of the Graves. This was prior to the before prior the to the ban. Yeah, yeah. It's really good against Eldritch. Uh, what would you uh, just out of curiosity for the people watching the uh, the profile now? What would you uh, do? You have anything in mind that you would replace the Call by the Graves by? Three tactical talents. Three tactical. Okay, so you wouldn't even keep keep the one Call by the Graves. I think it's at one, right? It's at one. Okay, okay. So tacticals. Okay, so good. Nice little swap out. That's, that probably Probably explains why tactic goes up to a hundred dollars now. Holy cow! All right. And it's What's a, next? All right. Up next, we have three pot of dualities. Okay. This searches out the deck to get your resources that you need. Uh, up next, we have three pot of desires. This is the heart and soul of the deck. Powers up Grand Maju to four thousand just on one activation. <laughs> Pretty good. <laughs> Next up, we have three pot of extravagance. All the pots. You got yes. the Trinity here. The Holy and Trinity. And if they negate it with Ash, you have pot of desires to fall back on since the effects are negated. Now, for the trap lineup, we have the Solemn Brigade. All the nose. Yes. Oh, damn. All highest rate of cash. Later games, right it always wins. That's crazy. Up next, we have three compulsory device. Doesn't destroy, just sends back to. The, it's really good against uh, destruction effects like Thunder Dragons. Next up, we have three impermanents. It's a staple of three of, so we have to play. And two Stormy Mirror Force. Two Stormy. It doesn't target, it returns back to the hand. Wins game, can I say? Sick. Big sports. Then obviously the extra deck is probably not even. It uh, doesn't even. It doesn't matter. When Pegasus says <laughs> Agnister, I shut the window, invoke, oh, invoke yeah. these. Let's shut down Construct. Oh yeah. Shut down Apocalypse. Oh yeah. Cypher and Omega. Super Foster relevant Warrior. cards. Yep. Just in case the mirror match. <laughs> uh, Dogmatica. Oh really? Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Okay. They send the cards. Up. Secure Gardner. Invoke Makaba. Enter this. Titan the Ash Dragon. Invoke Makaba and Elter. So no. All right. For the side deck. Side deck. Yeah. The side deck is pretty important. Two ma uh, Banisher of the Radiance okay. for the matchups against uh, Eldritch. 
three Nibirus for any combo deck, especially no um, no more Inferno Noble Knights. And if you saw, yeah, if you saw the uh, feature match against Ruben against Rocks, yes. you rocked him, rocked yes. him with this one. <laughs> Timed the right and won the game. Nice. Next up, three really match to try to break boards. Going mm -hmm. second because we're most likely going second. Uh, third, Lightning Storm. Just have to see it to uh, use it. Three Dark Ruler no more to to negate the full board and go off. And then two traps, two crackdowns, and steals monsters. Problematic monsters. That's why I play two. And an Imperial Order against any spell heavy deck, shadows, uh, invokes, stuff of that nature. That's it. That's all I have for you today. Thank you so much for the deck profile, man. Uh, appreciate it. What what were your matchups? Just a really quick. Uh, do you remember like um, what gave you a hard time or uh, anything like that? Anything notable from the tournament? Uh, rock decks. Rock decks. Yeah. There's the rocks and the Eldritch. Okay. Cool. And then going forward with this deck, you said you changed the call by the graves into triple tactics. Is there anything else off the top of your head you're still going to stick to this deck? I'm, I'm assuming going forward. Everything else, pretty much the same. Well, you took down some really big names everybody expected a uh, a ruben um or a ruben versus Andres final you ended up taking it out of everyone uh with an anti-meta deck at that so super exciting to see uh, i know a, lo a lot of the people on the stream and on the chat youtube are probably going to notice you from the stream so thank you again for the deck profile good luck in the the big tournaments going forward we're going to have a phantom rage regional here uh very soon so that's going to be huge um and uh, we'll see how you do there man thank you again for the deck profile congrats again till next time thank you